Okay, it's the end of the 1800s and the physicists, the scientists, think they've got it all figured out. Here's what they're thinking. Well, we got matter, we got waves. They're totally distinct from one another, you know? Uh, matter, particles, uh, they have mass and they have location, they're localized. And those waves, they're totally delocalized. They got no location whatsoever that you can describe. And, and, uh, and look at them, they're just, they're just weightless, they're massless. Okay, then along comes Max Planck into the 1900s and here's what he says. Through all my research and all the things that I've been looking at, matter, if it absorbs energy or releases energy, that's waves, it doesn't do so in a continuous fashion, which is what you would expect. But matter absorbs or releases energy in specific amounts, in chunks, in quanta. Now, what does that infer? That maybe that the energy itself is quantized or packaged in chunks. Oh, this, this threw everybody upside down. And here's what we developed from that. Let's go back a little bit and look at some of the physics. We have to understand the physics before we get to the chemistry later and talk about where electrons are in the atom itself. Okay. The speed of light equals wavelength times frequency. And I'm abbreviating frequency F here because that's kind of standard, although sometimes you'll see a written V for frequency. All right. And of course, a wavelength is just in a, in a wave, it's uh, the length between two equivalent points in that wave. Uh, here are the peaks, or could be that the troughs. Now uh, that's the wavelength and the frequency. How many of these pass by in one second? That's going to be the frequency. And so the unit for wavelength is in meters, and this is per second. So you get, for the speed of light, 2.9979 times 10 to the 8 meters. That's how far it travels in one second. That's very, very quick, isn't it? If you traveled from Earth to the moon, 1.2 seconds. Ready? Go. Stop. Ah, there you are, you're on the moon. That's how fast light travels. Impressive. Hey, Max Planck said, okay, quanta, chunks. So the energy that EMR, electromagnetic radiation, like light or heat, uh, microwaves, television ra waves, radio waves, they all travel at the speed of light, okay? The energy of that equals my constant, 6.626 times 10 to the negative 34 joule seconds, <laughs> times frequency. If you know the frequency of EMR, you can calculate the amount of energy that it possesses. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Because Planck's constant takes into account that you can, you understand that the energy is in, or the EMR is in quanta, or chunks. Einstein goes one better and he says, you know what, I can do some formulas here and some rearranging and I will actually suggest that E equals MC squared. Or, not only do we have chunks, okay, but there's an intraconvertibility between mass and energy. Oh man, if you know the mass of something accelerated to the speed of light squared, you can calculate the amount of energy that it possesses. Okay, whoa, 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 boy. This was absolutely validated, of course, when nuclear chemistry started in the 1930s. So we know that we can take a certain mass of something like uranium, and we can annihilate it and convert the matter to energy, and we can calculate how much energy comes off of that nuclear reaction, which is actually a nuclear fission. Okay, you look at this. You can, you can substitute into this formula, HF for E, and of course, lambda frequency for C. Do you know what that means? That means, and de Broglie found this out, that if you have the mass of something, you can actually calculate, because you know all these other constants, you can calculate a wavelength of a particular piece of mass. Oh, this is very astounding. Well, Bohr takes this, and he does some, some things that are quite fascinating with trying to determine the position of the electron in the atom in terms of energy levels by using a demonstration like the one you're going to see right now. 